Okay, Sandro, thank you very much for this uh, kind introduction. And I think we're going to have some interesting discussions at the end of this afternoon after this lecture. I'm fully open for new developments, and I think we will discuss that. As we have heard, I have slightly changed the title of my lecture uh, to how to use GBR in implant patients, because I have realized that in uh, the two titles of my yesterday's presentation and today have been very similar. So today I'm going to also talk about how to use the GBR technique when we are dealing with aesthetic disaster cases. I bring you the regards, as yesterday said, from uh, my hometown, Bern, Switzerland, not too far away from here, from Milan. It's a three-hour train ride, and also from the dental school in Bern, where I have been working now since 1980. So, as you know, uh, Professor Schroeder, the, the founding president uh, of uh, the ITI, has been working there and initiated the whole development of implant dentistry at our school in the early 1970s, actually by working together with Sami Sandhaus. We just have seen a histology from Sami Sandhaus, and I would not be surprised if that histology would have been processed at our university in the late 1960s. Okay. Now, if you want to have a handout of my lecture, then I offered that yesterday already. You send an email to info at ccde.ch. This is our continuing education department uh, that is handling all the CE courses we offer, including the master classes together with Professor Belser and also with uh, Professor Skoulian in the Perio department, with which we have an excellent, really excellent collaboration, which is not very used, I would say, around the globe. 